Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Babita and in this video, I will demonstrate how to do Kelesion removal. The procedure of Kelesion removal is known as Kelesion incision and curettage, which is a very simple and a very routinely done procedure in ophthalmology. As always, if you wish to see this video in Hindi, then you will find the link to my Hindi channel in the description box below. As you can see, this patient has a left upper lid Kelesion. The first step in Kelesion removal is to wear gloves and clean the area with a spirit soap. Then we infiltrate a local anesthetic lignocaine with epinephrine around the chalazion using a 26 gauge needle. After adequate anesthesia is achieved, you take a chalazion clamp, loosen its screw and insert it in such a way that the circular end is on the conjunctival side and the flat end is on the skin side. Then we close the clamp to catch the chalazion, avert the lid and tighten the screw to hold the clamp in its place and also to minimize bleeding. Then a surgical blade is taken, blade number 11 and an incision is made at the most protruding, the highest point of the chalazion. You can see in this video that I am holding the blade with my fingers but in an ideal situation or if you are a fresher, you should mount the needle on a BP handle and then make the incision or else you might accidentally injure yourself with the blade. While removing the chalazion from the conjunctival side as we are doing in this video, we must make a vertical incision because that is how the meibomian glands are oriented. If you make a horizontal incision, then you will end up cutting the adjacent uninvolved glands as well. So make sure that your incision is a vertical incision on the conjunctival side. If your incision is deep enough, you will see some gooey material come out through it. Then a Kelesian curette, also known as a Kelesian scoop is taken and it is used to scoop out the contents of the cavity. And after making sure that the cavity is clear and empty, we loosen the clamp, remove it, put antibiotic ointment inside the eye and bandage it and the bandage can be opened after 2 hours. Let's see another case. This is again an upper lid chalazion. This patient was a child, so the case was done under GA. The procedure is the same. You clean and drape the surgical area. Then you take a chalazion clamp, hold the chalazion, avert the lid and tighten the clamp. A vertical incision is made over the chalazion. A chalazion curette is used to scoop out the contents and the clamp is loosened and then removed and the eye is bandaged after putting an antibiotic ointment. In case you have any queries regarding this procedure, feel free to post them in the comment section below. I will be more than glad to answer them. Please like and share this video with your friends and colleagues if you found it useful and do subscribe to my YouTube channel to support free education. Thank you very much.